Cardio time, my favorite. So I'm gonna be using the Bowflex Max trainer today. I got some cheesy headphones I'm gonna put in so I can hear the TV clearly. I'm gonna put a program on, see how far I can go. I'm also gonna cover up the display with my cell phone. I don't wanna know how long I've been on there and how much time I have left. I believe in high-tech audio when I'm working out. Only the best, baby. Here we go. Yeah, I could do this for a half an hour. I don't like it. Feeling it. Definitely feeling it. It's been about 30 minutes. I want to quit. Another meal prep today. Real quick, didn't film the whole thing. Got a pork tenderloin, sweet potato. Let's cut this up. Mmm, the big boy. No scales, not yet. Not that crazy yet. Was the water running the whole time? Clean up, done. This will be the first time I ride this bike. First time on the spin bike. I'm gonna give it a shot. Ooh, hip hop. I'm gonna try a 30 minute rap ride. I don't know what the music is. I don't know how to ride the bike necessarily. You pedal, you turn the resistance. I'm gonna give it a shot. How hard can it be? Gotta raise the seat. I'm fine. I'm gonna start with a little warm up on my own. Oh, you can't stop pedaling. The weight of the wheel makes you, keeps you going. So I don't know if I can do 30 minutes of this. And I know I can't play the music that that lady's playing because I don't think you're supposed to do that on here. This is the 30 minute version of the rap ride. If you would like to extend it. I'll put my headphones on. Good thing I have one of these, it's a male. To a female, and it's like, I don't know, it's like eight feet long, and it can go all the way from the TV to me. An advertisement. I just started, and there's an advertisement. Standing up. I don't like standing up. Oh, fast. Oh, back down. Sweet spot, challenging and maintainable. <laughs> left, right, of course, left, right, lady. How else can it be? Ooh, they got some good music, though. What's the red zone? What's the red zone? In spin class, what's the red zone? Is that, that when it hurts? Yeah, I'm sweating. She's asking. Oh, standing. Oh, back down. Bike's quiet, right? Wow, bike doesn't make any noise. This is all you do is just ride, spin. Ugh. 10 seconds to what? 10 seconds to what? Oh. I forgot a water. Seven minute climb. Seven minutes climbing. Sixty. 
Oh, she tells you the RPM. Where's the RPM? Oh, there it is, RPM. Huh. Oh, 10 minutes. 10 minutes, I'm already feeling it. Just feeling it at two. Whew. Standing up's hard. Thirty minutes. Thirty. I feel light. I'm gonna weigh myself. I'm gonna weigh myself. I gotta do a, maybe even a before and after pick. Or video, before and after video. I still don't feel good, but I feel a little better than last time. I'll have to do a side-by-side. -side. Hey, let's do a side-by-side. -side. I'm trying to do a side-by-side. -side. Let's go check the scale. It's about time to get on the scale again. So it's been a month. I've been working out about three days a week, as I said. Cardio, very minimal. Just starting to pick up on that. But my diet's been pretty good. I've been pretty happy about my diet. Haven't really been counting calories so much or macronutrients or weighing my food not yet i'm not that crazy yet but I, I'm, I'm interested i've been doing some research on it but right now i just want to see what kind of a difference i made just by eating better cutting out the cupcakes the pizza calzones soda so whatever happens here i'm gonna be surprised either way <laughs> like the hair Just the pants and the socks. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. Ooh, 198. 198. <laughs> so I started out at 212, 198. So 14 pounds in a month, a little over three pounds a week with really no cardio, a little bit of lifting, diet. Diet, diet, diet. Ooh, a little excited right now. Feeling good. In all seriousness, three pounds a week, I'll take it. I know I can't keep up that pace, but I think just the change in my diet and the amount of calories I was taking in alone had to make a huge difference. I knew it would. At work, I'm always moving around. I don't sit at the desk all day, so I know that helps. So if I can add some more of that elliptical and the spin bike, maybe even do some running, who knows, maybe a 5K. Keep lifting three or four days a week. No doubt, I'm gonna look better, feel healthier. So far, so good. Pretty happy today. I've never really cared about the number on the scale. When I was skinny, I wanted to be bigger. When I'm fat, I wanna be smaller. The number, if I look good at 180, and like the way I look, I'm good. If it's 200, 190, it's not that important to me. But when I'm 212 and I'm all fat, to see the numbers go down lets me know I'm doing something right. Just want to be healthy. Just want to feel better, look better, be better. Just being committed to this makes me feel accomplished. Feels good. Feels good to put a little time into myself, a little effort into my health. I just hope I can keep it up. <laughs> but just that little bit of progress makes you think, wow, what can I do if I stay with this? And what will my after look like in six months, a year? I see what other people are doing online. Crazy. I wanna be crazy. I'm crazy. Well, that's it for today. As always, Click that like button, subscribe, ring the bell, drop a comment if you like, share if you like. Either way, I'll be back with more videos. Peace.